Here's today's In Touch devotion. Today's scripture reading is 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verses 23 through 26. For I received from the Lord that which I also delivered to you, that the Lord Jesus, on the night when he was betrayed, took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, This is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way, he also took the cup after supper, saying, This cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this as often as you drink it, in remembrance of me. For as often as you eat this bread and drink the cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. On the night he was betrayed, Jesus celebrated the feast of Passover with his disciples. During their shared meal, the Lord gave his followers a new interpretation of the Passover meal. By associating the bread and wine with his body and blood, Jesus revealed himself to be the true Passover lamb who takes away the sins of the world. Communion, also called the Lord's Supper, has been observed by believers ever since that evening, when Jesus said, Do this in remembrance of me. As those of us who are believers take communion together, we remember Christ's body and blood given for us at the cross, and also remember His provision for our daily life as He prepares us to spend eternity with Him. But by partaking in this feast, we also think of the future, when sin and death will have been defeated once and for all. It's at the wedding feast of the Lamb that we read about in Revelation 19 that we'll celebrate being in God's presence. Whether you feel close to or far from God today, know this. Your Creator loves you and invites you to sit at His table in this life and the life to come. His body and blood are the bread and wine that sustain Christ followers each day. His feasting table is a place of welcome, remembrance, and celebration for repentant believers. Will you accept His invitation 